The 2024 Ram Dakota is a brand new mid-sized truck that has just hit the market. It is the long-awaited rival to the Toyota Hilux and Ford Ranger, and it is sure to shake up the segment. Expected features. Asterisk exterior. The exterior of the Dakota is expected to be tough and muscular, with a prominent front grille and powerful lines reminiscent of the Ram 1500. It will likely be offered in a variety of crew cab configurations, with a short bed or a long bed. Asterisk interior. The interior of the Dakota is likewise expected to be spacious and functional, with plenty of room for passengers and cargo. Base models are expected to be rather basic with manual door locks and windows, along with a modest infotainment system. Higher trim additions are likely to be blessed with richer materials and feature a little more tech, like a large touchscreen infotainment system with Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. Asterisk engine. The Dakota is expected to be offered with a variety of engine options, including a base V6 engine, a turbocharged four-cylinder engine, and a powerful eco-diesel V6 engine. The 3.0-liter eco-diesel V6 is expected to offer 260 horsepower and 442 pound-feet of torque, making it a great option for those who need a truck that can handle heavy towing and hauling tasks. Uncertainties Asterisk gas mileage since the Ram Dakota is a new model, official gas mileage figures are not yet available. However, based on other mid-sized trucks on the market, it is expected to get around 21 miles per gallon combined. Asterisk towing and hauling capacity. Ram has not yet released official towing and hauling capacities for the Dakota. However, based on its competitors, it is expected to be able to tow around 7,500 pounds and haul around 1,600 pounds. Overall, the 2024 Ram Dakota is a promising new addition to the mid-size truck segment. It offers a stylish design, a comfortable interior, and a variety of powerful engine options. If you are in the market for a mid-size truck that can handle your work and weekend adventures, the Dakota is definitely worth considering.